To make a servo spin 360 degrees, first thing you do is disassemble the servo, remove the gears from the top, and then remove the bottom plate. Once you remove that, you'll see all the parts, the DC motor, my controller, and the potentiometer. Every servo is the same, they all operate like this. Once you hook it up to a battery and a receiver, uh, center your controls, make sure the trim centered also, and then you'll see the motor is rotating. On this servo, I removed the potentiometer out of the case to get to the potentiometer, but you just spin it with a screwdriver until the motor stops. Once you get the motor to stop, put a couple dabs of glue into the potentiometer to keep it from rotating. Most servos have a mechanical stop also, this one does, so you just need to take a Dremel tool uh, and cut off the mechanical stop. And then this uh, rod goes down into the potentiometer and rotates it, so I need to cut it off, so that way once you add that gear into the servo, it doesn't rotate the potentiometer. And then you just put all the gears back together, put the case back together, and then uh, you'll have a servo that spins 360 degrees.